So for the last month or two, the water on these two aquariums right here has been yellow. And for the life of me, I could not figure out why the water was turning yellow. I would do a water change. Within a week, it was back golden yellow. Now, either I hit the, a great golden substance of water, a supply of gold water, or there is something else going on. And I figured out what it was. My favorite brand, Tetra Jumbo Men Large Floating Sticks. The live food alternative for monster fish. And let's see if we can focus on this. If you look at the ingredients, let's see if I can focus it. And I know I saw it. Let's find it for you. There it is. You see it? It has yellow dye in it. Yellow. There it is. Yellow lake something. Number three or whatever it is. Which is causing. There it is. See it? Yellow Six Lake. What is that? But it is causing my tank to look like an actual lake. Because if you would take the water out of a lake, okay, you're going to get yellow water primarily. It looks kind of yellow. It has a little yellow tint to it. So they've added this yellow six late to the food content for my fish which in turn has turned my water yellow we are no longer using this food because I do not like the look of yellow water now this one right here has just had a water change about a 40 percent and that's because over here, since I've done a whole filtration media change, I have a leak in this particular filtration system. So, until the new one arrives, this water right here is going to look kind of cloudy. So, I'm turning it on sporadically throughout the day. To clean the water and make sure it stays within its pH level and healthy level and everything else that it needs in order for camo here to thrive. He's doing really well. He likes the water pump on. And if you look in the very back to his, or to our left, there's a long black stem, and that is an extra filtration system with some of the media from this filtration system incorporated to run even when I turn this one here, which has a leak, off. So the supplier of this filtration system is sending me a new one because I purchased it. Uh, May of this year and so he was very reasonable I am definitely ordering the other two new ones with the UV sensors UV lights I'm sorry uh, from him because he really did a wonderful job in um, solving the issue with this one right here now it looks like a sun sun it is not branded like a sun sun but it is exactly like the Sun Sun. So pretty much it's a Sun Sun with a different name on it. Same machine, different name. But we're more used to hearing about the Sun Sun filtration systems. Who, of course, whom, of course, I love. 
Now, I know there's other filtration systems out there called Nevo, Fuvo, I think it is, I'm sorry, Fuvo, and Eham, and I have just not been able to bring myself, even though I love my aquariums very much, to spend that type of money on those filtration systems. These filtration systems are reasonable by far. So I'm going to take this one, um, and I have two of these that are attached to the both of the 40 breeders, and I'm going to attach them to the 20 gallon um, aquariums for extra tanks. Yep, the yellow is coming from the food. I had to figure it out. I had never in the lifetime of having an aquarium had yellow water. Here is the problem. Right here. Bye bye, Jumbo Me or Jumbo Men. You have to go. It says it tastes like real food. I would rather give them real food than to give them something to make my water look like that. That just doesn't look good to me. And I'm sure, you know, lake water looks exactly the same. But for home decor and aquatic beautification, this is not it. At all. <laughs> so I just wanted to send a little video to let you know what my issue was regarding the yellow aquarium. Now it has been solved. So they might not like the new food. Um, but definitely, I don't like the yellow water. This is Yolanda. Doing a little vid on. If your water is yellow, it's either a chemical or food that's causing this type of situation. Bye-bye.